Hello, 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 hello everyone! Hello, welcome back! Welcome back to your friendly neighbor noob. Of course, today we are going to cover another series, and this series is the Outer Worlds! 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 Now, I have actually played this game before. I loved playing it, but I only ever got halfway because I kept restarting it and trying new things. So this time, I am forcing myself to go from start to finish. And I want to know how this ends. I'm really excited to figure it out and, let, you know, go along the way. Uh, so this series will last as long as it needs to last. And we're going to have a lot of fun. But we're going to push right through. And I'm going to say, don't forget to like, subscribe, share with all your friends. And comment down below any video you'd like to see me do a series on rather than an 8-hour challenge. Uh, it be much appreciated. And hopefully you'll enjoy this as much as I will. Anyway, guys, let's get right into it. Don't forget to eat spaghetti. And let's... Go! <sighs> we stand on the edge of the war. And all we're gonna do is go tell Catherine that Clive is dead and that she can take over the Bratwurst. I forgot to do that. I literally just did not cross my mind. She was the least important storyline in all of this. Have you seen Arthur today? <sighs> it's sad, but it's kind of true. She did not even... I didn't even remember until now. Hi, Catherine. Please say the Oda corpse you're wearing is Clive's. Um, Sutter House Clive is deceased. Huh. Not much boast to that declaration. Am I to take that to mean you didn't kill him? Oh my god, uh, how many knuckleheads did you send to murder him? Of course it was me. Hired more than were successful, can tell you that. Still, this ought to compensate for your troubles. And take an I doubt it. You stink like Sisty Pig. I doubt it. I very much doubt it. <sighs> well, I got a whole bunch of stuff, and thank you for the aromatics. Um, I don't know if that really helped the situation, now did it? However, I do feel like it's time to go to that gunship and get those modules. Very interesting situation, if you ask me. Even though the sulfur pits are there, I have been there. Huh. I think that's probably closer. Hopefully nothing's respawned, otherwise I'm going to cry. This is very dangerous, by the way, this place. Anything respawned? No? No? Really? <gasps> I love it. Nothing respawned, because we murdered everything here. Yes. Okay, so we're going to make our way towards the crash ship. Both sides seem to want the module. However, I'm the one that decides who gets it. Oh. Eyes up, boss. But We're where? Into the jaws of danger. Oh my god, not again. He feels... I, I don't think he gets or grasps the, the, the danger that we're in it most most of the time. He just seems to think this is fun. I don't know. Sometimes I worry about him. Sometimes. Not often. But sometimes. There we go. Hi. Oh, level 20. Yeah. Nice round number. That's pretty good. I, I don't know the, the last time I made it to that level. Um, I think I made it on that level for my main character. I hope so. Oh, drug addiction. Temperament perception, drug addiction withdrawals. I'm good. I don't want a drug addiction, thank you. It keeps on asking me, and I know that it's cool to have extra perks and everything, but is it really worth having extra perks if you're gonna have a thing like drug addiction? You know what I mean? It just doesn't seem worth it. You get one extra perk if you are willing to have something that really decreases a part of your combat or you. I know I just don't feel that's, you know, worth it. Damn. It like fully crashed. Like, I doubt there's any survivors. Oh, no, well, it looks like someone came out here. Oh, the Marauders tried to come out here. Oh, that's cute. The Marauders did come out here. Oh. Excuse me, excuse me, pardon me. 
Oh, yep, yeah, I gotta get the captain's. Uh, is, the, is there a captain here? Uh, no. Eject captain's command key. Uh, run diagnostics. Start Mayday playback message. Hello. Uh, again and again, the fixing. Oh my god, I love her. She's like, I thought I told them he was a, they were idiots, but no, they didn't listen. Okay, there we go. I'm gonna go have a discussion with Zoya, Zora. Give it to Graham. Give it to Sanji. <laughs> I'm putting up the middle finger as hard as I can. I bet you are. I bet you really are. Okay, I'm not gonna give it to him. I'm not gonna give it to him. I want to go talk to Zora. I believe she'll have a way out of this. A way of dealing with this that doesn't include me giving him what he wants. <laughs> At all. <sighs> Where's Zora? Oh, she's not there. Okay. Oh, there she is. Hey, Zora. Captain, we should chat. Yes, we Graham's should. Graham's got the right idea, but he isn't the right guy to execute it. I don't even think he's motivated by philosophism anymore. I think he's just guilt-ridden. Probably. I can't believe I'm even saying this, but... You want to take over. I keep going over and over it in my head, and the only way I see the Iconoclast surviving is we depose him. I'm with you there. Let's go talk to him. Okay. Deep breaths. This is what's best, Sora. Time to save Monarch. Agreed. Let's go. <sighs> I really don't know how this is going to go. But I don't think he's going to go down willingly. Captain, you must be back with the access codes to our new ship. Graham, we need to talk. We have work to do. This isn't the time for one of our spats. I'm sorry, Graham, but Zora's taking over. What? Zora? You're running the Iconoclast into the ground, and I don't believe it'll get better after we take Stellar Bay. The troops take orders from me already, and you've... You've brought me as far as you can down the eternal path. It's time to This is down. hard to watch. The troops. Damn. Listen to you. This isn't an army. They aren't soldiers. They're believers. Followers. They pick up a gun because you tell them to, not because they want to. And you, Captain, after all you've done for me, for us, you throw behind this mutinous blasphemer? I do. She's got the best interests of the uh, kind of class I at heart. I built this movement from the ground up. I've brought freedom to Monarch, and all these years mm, later, we're still bring it free. Up. I joined because I believed that you were in it for the Iconoclast. Yep. That you wanted nothing more than to bring freedom to Halcyon. That you were selfless. However. But I know the truth now, Graham. I know what happened in Amber Heights. You didn't start this movement because you wanted to save us. You wanted to save yourself. No. Oh, the guilt's coming out. Those deaths are on your hand, Graham. No amount of meditating will clean you of them. I've spent years atoning for my sins. I've studied, meditated, taught. I built the Iconoclast so that any man could cast away his past for a fresh start. That's Seems answer, you couldn't Graham? do that to yourself. You needed a fresh start? After all those innocent lives? So many lives. I'm sorry. I believed in you once. I did. But it's over. Stand down. Agreed. I won't. What happened back then was a mistake, and the colony has moved on. This is my movement. These are my people. If you want to lead them, you'll have to kill me. That isn't necessary. Please. We don't want to do that, do Graham. This, Graham. If this is where my path ends, I accept it. But as long as I draw breath, I will not abandon them. You kind of already have by so be it. making your choices, Let's but okay. <laughs> he was easy to kill. That was sad. You okay, Zora? Well, Captain, here we are. Killed a lot of people in the name of the Iconoclast, and it never feels right. But this time, it's... Especially wrong. Especially wrong. 
You've got the... Void, help me. I'll never remember what that thing is called. The device from the ship. Do you have it? Hold on. I think you and Sentia should join forces. I thought about it, but... I think we're too far gone. Pulling Carlotta's support was crossing a line. Sanjia has corporate resources you can use to spread your message. You know, Captain, I never thought about that. Maybe he could be taught the eternal truth. Spread the message from within the corporations. All right. If he's willing to talk, I'll give him a chance. Wonderful. That was a long shot, but I'll try. This could actually work. They could actually bring peace. But I wanted my chaos. How is this chaotic? Oh, I hate it when I'm doing good things. Now I have to convince Sanji to pe do peaceful stuff. Oh, I hate peace. Why is peace so easy? Why are they making peace so easy? Ah, oh, I hate it. I hate it so much. If the Iconoclasts reach that ship first, there won't be any chance for a peaceful monarch. I don't suppose you've found the targeting module yet. I have. Controls, but they're running into trouble with the Iconoclasts. I have. However, could you agree to a truce with the Iconoclasts? They're all mad. And what's more, they left us. I don't see any way for us to work together. I've read your reviews, Sanji. You can't, you can't do this alone. Oh, not this again. <laughs> Remember what we practiced, sir. Breathing. Yes. The words in those reviews were very hurtful, but they do not define me. I am a Manta Pillar. Sure what now? Kaku. I can emerge and become whatever I wish. You're good with details. You can see someone who, uh, you could use someone who sees the bigger picture. You too. He has a point, sir. And it's not all bad. Supposing you're right, who exactly would you have me work with? The Iconoclasts are not the most compromising sorts. Zora leaves the Iconoclasts now. What about her? That's an interesting suggestion. I confess I don't know much about her except that she worked for Rizzo. There ain't a body on this planet that can keep a group patched up like she has. I don't know how she does it. I'd be willing to consider it. But I need to see her review first. Alright. Fine. I'll find it. Excellent. Her review would be in the Rizzo offices in Cascadia. Bring it to me, and I'll see if she's qualified. Okay. I'll let you know when I've made progress. So now we have to go find a review to prove that she's good enough? Oh, you make me want to punch you in the face. Kind sir. You know, meanwhile, while all this is happening, there's also someone who got murdered uh, because of toss ball betting, and I haven't even bothered to look into that. Someone was actually murdered. There was an actual death. And there was clues. And hints. And everything that I could have looked into. But no. I decided why not help with this. The modules. It all makes sense. It's easy. It's going to be over in a second. I am dumb as fuck. <laughs> oh. How I could have stood by my decisions. But nope. Oh god. Okay. Oh god. Alright, looks like we're heading in. Well, I was going to go sneaky, but you know what? Boom! Boom! And... Boom! He tripped over and died. It was great. Oh dear. Well, I may not have killed them, but they cer he certainly died. These guys are awesome. I love that I gave them the, a really nice weapon. Like, they have unlimited... They have unlimited uh, ammo, so they can shoot as much as they want with what, uh, what are their weapons. So give them a weapon that does a lot all at once. You know? They're never going to run out of ammo. So, mini guns, flamethrowers, those are the weapons you want to give them. The big ass weapons. Sure. Oh, hi! Oh dear, all your body parts came off when I hit you. I'm sorry? Question mark? It's time. Oh. Ooh. Open this up. Oh, nice! Monies! Yes, thank you. 
That's Spacer's choice. Right. Let's have a look in here and see if we can find anything. Oh, I'm in combat. Oh, so I am. Hmm. Oh, never mind. All good. All good. View data. Uh, executive review. Top notch sawbone. Hmm. Employee of the month. Export. There we go. Wonderful. Now we can go give that to him and prove that she's the best option. <sighs> okay. Here we go. Give Sanji a... Uh... Any luck bringing the Iconoclast to the bargaining table? Well... I don't like the idea that they'll be trying for that module while we delay. Give him Zora's review. Very well. I can't promise anything, but... Let's see what we have here. Yes, we can definitely well, try. And that's like what's he, really uh, important. She's actually very qualified. Yes, yes, it does seem like she's very qualified. Her, I'd wager the Iconoclast would have died off a while ago. All right. I'll have yes, yes, I definitely agree. With, without her, they would have died out years leaders. ago. Who would have known? And we'll discuss terms. Hmm. Very well. Looks like we're going to the old church to have a discussion, a negotiation, nonetheless. Hey, I, tried I can't even negotiate it. with my cat, whether to sh shut the hell up sometimes. <laughs> my cat's just meowing in the background drink constantly. Drink or greatest drink. He it's wants attention. Taste, but, it ain't bad. Gave me a but I have a negotiation to do with. Oh, oh wow. Work in progress, okay. I'm close to a breakthrough. Oh wow. I should add more sugar. Okay. The headaches on account of the sugar. Hey, thanks for coming. Of course. I wish I'd had more time to prepare a proper analysis on the costs and benefits of your proposed union, but uh, I suppose we'll have to improvise. Gotta admit, I really thought I was walking into a trap here. I'm ready. If it were, I wouldn't be standing here all vulnerable like. That's true, you'd have a gun Sanji, at the ready. Stellar Bay's got food and walls. Mm -hmm. And my people need both. If you'll have us, we're willing to share the space. Do you have any idea what that would cost? Why, drawing up the budget alone is going to take weeks. You don't have weeks, uh, uh, Sarge. Zora, ready to storm the city right now. What if they uh, just supported your supply lines? Not good enough. I need to move a fair amount of my people into the city. We need shelter, Captain. Understandable. I'm not saying you live outside, just help the wilderness out once in a while. I suppose some of our healthier folk could offer aid. Some of us need to stay in the city proper, though. Well, I'll be damned. You two can work together? Maybe there's some hope for this yeah, place Yeah, maybe. All. Maybe. Truly Don't curse it. I'm not sure I'd ever have heard as much from Graham. Graham was a murderous fiend. And I'd be shocked if you didn't already know that. <laughs> Something tells me Sanjo didn't know. This feels like one of those times when everyone at headquarters but me is laughing at something. But you two aren't laughing. Yeah, we are not laughing. Amber Heights, you hallhead. Ten years ago, Graham had all those people killed. What? That's not possible. Even for him. That's going too far. Uh, it is. We found correspondence between him and the pirates. But that means... I had no idea, I swear. Look, we were both fed up with corporate leadership, but I, I never guessed he'd do something like that. Mr. Nandi says he don't know a thing. I say we take his word for it. Well, he seemed pretty you clueless. You can't take bureaucrats at their word. You back someone into a corner like this, and they'll say anything to get out of it. He seemed pretty confused. Take it back, to Notch Zoro. You were here for your people, not the past. I... Okay, okay. And he didn't seem to know. He was very confused about what we were talking about. It'll take me a while to get over losing Graham. You know, I felt the same way years ago when he first left. There was something magnetic about him that lets you ignore the things you didn't want to see. But surely you know what that's like. Yeah, I, I do. Oh, okay. they're seeing eye to eye. Supply some of us. I'll have our more capable soldiers help out. Ah, oh, so much peace. I'm hopeful about this alliance. As am I. Oh, I am. Um, feel my blood pressure lowering already. 
Oh. Thanks for coming out, Sandar. I, uh, guess I'll see you at Stellar Bay. Gotta be honest, Captain. Never thought I'd see the day. You've done a good thing for Monarch here. I hope so. I bloody well hope so. Oh, Jesus. This was an alliance I did not expect to happen. At all. Ever. What the hell? After all that peace that we just created, now we have to go figure out what happened to someone who was murdered. It's like we put all the huge problems aside and decided, you know what, let's do a little bit of a murder mystery. I, I honestly, I, I feel like it's probably a nicer thing to take it down a notch, you know, after all of what just happened. Oh, uh, hi there. Ooh, you're the new face. Wow, you must be up on all the latest Hostile games. So who do you follow? Wait, don't tell me. You look like a Hammersmith Thunder fan. No, Glacial Age Mammoths. I'm not here about that. I'm here, I'm not here to chat about, uh, it's about teams. That's a shame. Tossball's just about the only good news we get around here. Uh-huh. When our frequency's not too clogged up anyway. Well. I get to listen to games all day? Stellar Bay really is a paradise. It's pretty swell, but it's a whole lot better with company. Oh, Jesus. Say, I don't He's think mine, I've back before, off. And I'd remember that face. I'll try not to be a stranger then. My name's Felix, by the way. <clears throat> Look at me getting carried away again. Yeah, Felix is so, mine. Back the fuck off. <laughs> I found this bit of slip on a dead man's apartment. Any idea what might have happened to him? Poor Isaac. I was wondering why I hadn't seen him in a few days. I'd really like to help. Isaac was a sweet fellow, even if he did have terrible teeth. Okay. Cut that to the chase. Do you know who did it or not? I don't know for sure. But I saw Elijah and his buddies pushing Isaac around. Okay. They're hooligans from Fallbrook. They sweep into town, drop supplies off behind the warehouse, and spend the rest of their stay getting rowdy over tossball games. They usually loiter in the alley behind the yacht club. They're not allowed in the bar anymore. I bet you anything Isaac ran into trouble with one of them. All right. Thanks for the tip. Mr. Sanjar will be pleased to hear about it when you're done. I know he gets fed up with the Fallbrook bullies, but there's not much he can do. Well, let's go speak to Elijah and see if he has any information about a dead person. Ah, I like how peaceful this is compared to bringing peace, strangely. You know, it was just so much more stressful trying to please everyone, and now all I have to do is find a murderer. This is so nice. Ah, oh, let's go around here. There we go. Hello there. Hi. Who the fuck are you? This ain't your alley. Hey, what are you doing here? This is our How is this secret, secret alley? alley when people know it's an Bird alley? Are already pissed by those crates to market. I know you murdered Isaac. Listen, that purple tooth twerp had it coming. Not that anyone has proof. And not that it's any of your business. Um, fine. Wrong answer. <laughs> Oh no! My decre I decreased my, my um my reputation with them. How horrible! Yeah, it's so decreased. I so care. <laughs> I care so much. I must thank you for your excellent recommendation regarding Zora. She's most capable. Yes, yes, she is. Anyway, what can I do for you? Um. Well, I'm here about a murder. But that's terrible. What happened? Uh, I've taken care of it. The killers but are dead. means we won't be able to log their testimonies. No, we won't. How terrible. If there's one thing I've been hoping to re-establish in Stellar Bay, it's proper documentation for legal matters. Something to be said for that. Live and learn, I suppose. Yes, yes, Still, I agree. your intervention in the matter is much appreciated. Please consider this payment for your services. Thank you for your time. How are uh, things going around in Stella Bay these days? Quite well, as a matter of fact, Zora is proving most capable. Well, that's you good to hear. The she pounds the table and gets straight to the point. It makes for some rather exhilarating meetings. I know I had my concerns initially, but your instincts were right. Zora and her compatriots have become valuable and productive members of our community. Good to hear. And since we're back in the board's good graces, we've got real growth prospects to look forward to. What can I do for you? 
No, no, nothing, nothing. It's all good. Well done. Now, to deal with your little problem. I love that we're dealing with small little problems right now because that's all we have left. Uh, flowers. I believe flowers for Sebastian. Okay. Uh, let's talk to Sebastian. Let him know that she likes him. Hey, buddy. Hello, stranger. Can I interest you in a raptodon tongue? Or maybe some canid toenails? You look like a man who's looking for some mostly fresh animal parts? I am not. Sebastian, you ever get your hands on those pheromone sacks? Manipillers ain't gonna hunt themselves, you know. I must have hunted a dozen. But I couldn't find a single sack on any of them. I must be looking in the wrong place. <laughs> Manipillers ain't got pheromone sacks. I just told him that so he'd stop asking me for advice. Uh, At least I'm getting a good haul of claws in the process. <laughs> I You're suppose. You're in good hands, traveling with Monarch's top merc. Still, if you want any rat glands or manty claws, I've got you covered. If you say so. Um, let's talk about Celia. I haven't seen her in a few days, but I've been meaning to ask her how that rapted on acid is working out. I hope it's working okay, because no one else really seems interested in this stuff. Yeah, true, true. She likes you. It's nice of you to say. I like her too. She's interested in you romantically. Wait, I see what's going on. She put you up to this so she could get a discount, hmm? Don't get me wrong. Oh my god, like you're an idiot. She's a real fine lady. Always talks nice and slow, so I understand. But if I give her one... I won't hardly make a bit, on account of no one else having any use for rapted on tongues. Don't take my words. Spend time with her. I promise she won't ask for a discount. You sound pretty sure. And she is awful nice. Okay, I'll do it. Once her shift ends, we'll go someplace nice. Maybe to Chef Raymond's. Oh, That sounds lovely. And you're still a bumbling idiot. Have you talked to Sebastian yet? What did he say? He's an idiot. Okay, but how did he say it? Did he sound excited? Oh my or god. like he was just agreeing to it? Was just, he like, Yay, just kick back, back my god. Waiting for this, or was it more, sure, I don't have anything else going on. You guys are awful. I hate you both. He likes you, Celia. Just don't ask for any discounts. Not to worry. If I never buy another Raptodon tongue, it'll be too soon. Good. Ah, look at me going on. I'm sure you've got other things to do, and Mr. Nandi's giving me that back to work look. Anyhow, thank you. How has everything suddenly got dumber? Right, it seems that we only have like one more thing to do here, which is Where's check out the I camp have? just around the corner. Just kidding. The guy never said. Outside. Okay. You know they call it Devil's Peak. Ain't really a peak. I agree. It's, you know, two peaks. Now we've got to find his camp. Where is it? He said to first. Oh, there it is. How oh, cute. Cute little uh. Oh, camp. I suppose. Hi there. Bathroomed. Hey, Manic Queen Slayer. Glad you made it in one piece. After all, not everyone's so lucky. No, no. It's... Meet my corporate compliance crew. Oh, they these check guys. Check out our weapons locker inside. I reckon you'll find something you like. All then right. Then we call it even between us. Okay. Um, I'll keep an eye out for that. Yay! Level twenty-one. That that that's awesome. You know what? I'll just take everything. No, they don't. They don't need it. They're, they're, they're not even really doing their job. Unlock without key. I don't know what that means, but okay. Um, the the amount of times I've gone to sleep while trying to pick something up is awful. I'll take everything. Oh, thank you. That was very kind of them. I believe I hear people <sighs> in Hawaii discussing the latest Aetherwave cereal. I'm sure they are, but we have better things to do. We have to go see Phineas at his lab. This is going to be interesting. 
Interesting indeed. We've arrived at Phineas's orbital lab. All right. Let's go. I'm worried. I don't know what to expect. Hello? Oh, wh what? Can you hear me? Yes, I can Does hear you. Work? Oh, damn it. I'm just securing my ongoing experiments. Of course you are. And securing myself. Mind the mess. Uh, I haven't had a visitor since... Uh, in fact, I've never had a visitor. Okay. Oh. Um, hello. Hello, the bird. You. I'd clap you on the shoulder if I weren't behind a wall of bulletproof glass. I don't know why you're behind there, but okay. But Hiram Blythe just sent me everything I needed. According to Hiram's message, Minister Clark has ordered a suspicious amount of dimethyl sulfoxide. That is, that is quite strange. Hoarding the colony's remaining supply. Why? Typical elitist. Hoarding supplies during a time of scarcity. Once I have those chemicals, we can revive the Hope's colonists and put some decent people in charge. I, I suppose, so, but... News. You're going to Byzantium and stealing those chemicals. Exciting. I... Um, you make it sound so simple and easy. Oh, I understand it must seem impossible to you. Infiltrate Byzantium, the crown jewel of the colony. Yeah. Steal a batch Isn't of like the, from a the pretty upper, upper class place? I'm going to feel a little out of place there myself. Divided into a series of smaller, less impossible tasks. So what's the plan? Ah, yes, the details. I'm not about to ask you to rampage through Byzantium trading bullets with the board's agents. We'll have to resort to subterfuge. Carmen Imagawa. She's my contact in Byzantium. Okay. Meet her at the docks. She'll have she all the oh, necessary oh. intelligence you require. Great. This is a lot to take in. Nav key to Byzantium. You'll need it to land in the Golden City. Remember, you're looking for dimethyl sulfoxide. Big green bubbling Big green vessel. Bubbling vessel with a warning label. All right, so um, I'll see if I can find it. That's a great description. Find Carmen Yaguana. Uh, Gim Imagua. Imagawa. Uh, Imagawa. Still chemicals. Got it. Okay, guys, we get to go to Byzantium and steal chemicals. Fun. Let's go. We're going to be thieves today. Sounds like a laugh riot. I am 100% screwed. But it's for future friendly to deal with. And by future friendly, I mean next episode friendly. <sighs> Such a wonderful, wonderful. Wonderful place to, to finish. Uh, just full of uh, all terrible things and uh, just great. Um, well, I guess there we go. Well, well, well. Looks like we've come to the end of the episode. That's right, we've come to the end of this episode. But don't worry, there'll be heaps more. I'm so excited to get through this. I'm really excited to get to the end and finally figure out what happens at the end. I have not had that experience yet, which is a little weird. Not knowing what's going to happen at the end of your video game, but really, I'm super excited to figure it out, and I hope you are too. So let's get to the next episode. Come on, let's go, let's go. Well, actually, you'll have to wait a week. I'm, I'm sorry, but um, they're a weekly thing. <laughs> yeah, I'll see you next time, guys. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and share with all your friends. Don't forget to eat spaghetti, and I'll see you next week. Goodbye, so long, farewell. Goodbye.